my daughter suffered a lot. I wasn't with her the last week, but the week before I was with her. And it was really, really tough to see her continue to, to slide, and yet I just had this hope that she was going to recover. I was, uh, I, uh, I was not prepared to get the news that she had passed away, but uh, I, I know it sounds trite, but one might say she's in a better place. When we all talked about it, it was about remembering Katie and how hopeful and how spectacular, I mean, there's no words to describe her fully. Like, she was amazing in all aspects, and so we wanted that to kind of, you know, be the breath of life in the service and remembering her that had to be the core, you know, is her, and so of course it would have been. It was the, all the songs that she loved, it was all the people that she loved most involved, so that only can bring about hopefully hope, hope and, and realness. Everybody gathered and was together and loved each other and and that's shown through. And, and that, you know, lots of people have said that they were inspired. And again, that's, you know, that's all that she wanted to do. So I know she would have been so pleased, so happy, and totally blown down by it. <laughs> Katie would have been happy with, uh, with a vibe that, that celebrated and allowed people to uh, remember, to grieve, to rejoice, and uh, celebrate what uh, the great lady that she was. I loved my daughter, and I miss her horribly, but uh, our time will come. She just came as it was, even if she would say the things that other people were afraid to say, you know. She just was always in the moment, always trying to reach out to everybody in the room and make, you know, even like from stage, she would make sure she made eye contact with everybody in the room, even, and she would focus in on the person that looked the saddest or um, the loneliest and just, she had a way about her eyes could just pierce people and people thought that she was singing directly to them and she you know, definitely reveled in that and wanted to bring that every time she came to the stage. Um, but I mean, more so in her life, it's the same, you know, just living with reckless abandon, but um, healthy, reckless abandon, you know what I mean? And um, she's astounding, she is. I walked up to your door It would be ironic that in her death she might receive more public acclaim than she did during her life. But the fact of the matter is, she touched thousands of lives and made them all better. And uh, what, what, can you, what can you do more than that to make somebody else's life better? Would that we all would leave this world having made, having enriched other people's lives and not make it a gimme, 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 which our society is so much about. Well, Katie was a give, give, give. And uh, that'll be a great legacy. That is a great legacy for her. This can live on, make other people better even in her death.